Hey guys, welcome back with another video of Spikes Family episode 21. Anyways, yeah, um, before we start, and yeah, we bought some food from Pizza Pizza Hut. And a Pizza 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 Pizza. Which is, it's not really pizza, because this one I ordered like chicken wings with barbecue. So as. So, let's enjoy the show. To it as well. As proposed, it is now a joint operation. Don't let us down. Yes, ma'am. Fiona Frost, a clerk at Berlin General Hospital. Her true identity, a wise agent. Relay the update to Twilight as well. You two can work out your plan of attack together. Yes, ma'am. Make sure none of this gets in the way of Operation Strix. This comes second. How is Strix progressing? Slow for herself. They call her ruthless, cold-blooded, and brazen. She pursues her missions with a face of stone, showing no hint of emotion. Code name: Nightfall. A woman driven by ambition. Husband is out walking our dog with our daughter at the moment. Is he? <laughs> Yes, I'm well aware. That's why I'm here. Your daughter left something behind when she came to visit the hospital the other day. I wanted to return it. Oh, her magnifying glass. Thank you. This is very thoughtful. Wow. She's so beautiful. Yes. Not as beautiful as you. Come on, you're, you're beautiful. Yeah, she, Nightfall is beautiful, but you're the most beautiful character. You're the most beautiful woman. Oh. What is it? Nothing! Your home is quite lovely. What, does she think I'm her husband's mistress or something? Though yeah, you are. No, I'm kidding. I think, yeah, I know. I think, yeah. It's kind of obvious that Nightfall has a crush on Twilight. Suppose I can play this little girl with his wife, so she's not entirely wrong. The decorating was my husband. My husband. You're a liar. If you were delaying Operation Strix, I'll personally see to it you're disposed of. But with the skill with which this woman carries herself, I may never find an opening. Outside of Erie and Frankie, this is the first guest we've had over. I'm so nervous. I'm a housewife. A regular housewife. You are. Attempting to take care of her myself would be too risky anyway. Far better to make her leave this house of her own volition. It's like the way Nightfall is looking at your it's so intimidating. Because she thinks, like, she's not gonna be a better wife for Lloyd. But I- but- we all know that yours is gonna be a better wife, and she is. Now, if she were down in the dumps around the clock, that would be a real challenge. But I'm lucky that the two of us are able to have so much fun together. Hmm. So she sees herself as the girl's mother. Well, actually, parenthood does seem a bit challenging for Lloyd, considering everything he has to do for work and around the house. Be Wait, does does Nightfall know that they're just? A makeup bully family, or she doesn't know. Because I think she knows that they're make make believe for your family. Because of me. Exactly. You need to acknowledge your inadequacy. You aren't fit for this mission. Oh, Why does she? She looks like she hates her. Why does she hate yours? Oh my god. She's jealous. That. Well, since you brought it up. I often hear Dr. Forger complain. Something about his wife always. We have returned safely! Oh. Welcome back! <laughs> oh. oh, hi, Fiona. What Fiona? are you doing here? Hello, Doctor. Good to see you. So her name is Fiona. Fiona. I thought I had. You know, never mind. <laughs> I don't want to say anything. She came by to return something that you left behind at the hospital. I see. Well, thank you. She came all the way to my home? Is there an emergency? That wasn't a very long walk, was it? It was starting to look like rain, so we cut it short. You could have just given me this at work. I was out running a few errands, and it was on the way. Whoa! This lady's a spy, too? I see. Anya, she's a spy. Of course she knows. Local supermarket? What is she up to? Agents are supposed to avoid unnecessary contact. 
Yeah. Yes. I think she came there just to win Lloyd. And of course she's head over heels. Oh my goodness, she's way over the top. You guys, Fiona, aka Nightfall, I knew it. She's in love with Lloyd Forger, Twilight. You see how her eyes are like, there's so much sparks in there. Oh my goodness, <laughs> so funny. And then Anya's like reading her mind, like, of course. I, yeah, of course, she's head over heels and she's in love, but it's more like obsession now. She needs to chill. Because your will always be the love of Lloyd's. <laughs> uh, was it the love of his life? Yeah. Mm, this is delicious nightfall. I'm glad to hear it. Oh my god. He has so much nothing. You're just the best. You flatter me. Oh, my life. You're my earnings for the month. Use them however you'd like. Nightfall, you're just. Oh, I've also extensively researched your enemies for your next mission. What kinds of weapons they use, their names, ages, and how many great bears they have. Absolutely incredible. It's always nightfall. How perfect can you be? I don't need that dim with a wife anymore. For the sake of world peace, let's get married, nightfall. Oh, dear Twilight. I'm all yours and not just. I think everyone is crushing on Twilight. Of course, yeah. He's handsome, but I'm sorry, I wouldn't go for that type of. I was like. So perfect. Code name Nightfall. A woman driven by ambition. Specifically, he's driven by ambition to marry Lloyd Forden just to win him over. Yeah, see? I told you. Qualified to be his wife than her. See? That's her goal. Her goal is to overthrow your um, position as a housewife and um mother but i think anya would never approve that if i would if i'm anya never approve that i mean i will treat her like a friend or someone to look up to but no fiona can just never take that i'd give him all the support he needed both on his missions and at home we would honeymoon on a romantic tropical island what is she thinking oh, think about you how about i pour us all some coffee which she's just always so clumsy and useless. Maybe I'll report her to the authorities. Hey, Fiona, want to be my wife instead? Wait, are you serious? Sure, I guess I could come over sometime. <laughs> but even if he does feel that way about me and wants me gone, I can't exactly blame him. No! I can't believe you're thinking that. Oh my gosh, I feel bad. You're, no! You're too precious. You can't. Don't try that. You're the best. You're really the best. I'm sorry to Fiona, but I choose your for Lloyd. You didn't get burnt, did you? I'm sorry, I made a mess. <laughs> what a well, child. Yet yeah, we're That's eating them properly. <laughs> Guys, I'm gonna. Okay, this is off topic, but like, since we're eating chicken, like, this is like chicken wings, and she ate a chicken sandwich. We're eating chickens, and I said we feel bad that we're eating chickens. But they're animals. But it's, it's delicious. They're delicious. I'm sorry. Mmm, I feel bad. We're eating chickens. Anyway. Yeah, um. Sorry, but like, Fiona's character here, it's funny. But at the same time, I'm like, mm, no, she doesn't match well with Lloyd. She's not compatible with him. Sorry. If I were her lover, I'd manage her schedule by the minute. I'd whip that girl into shape both physically and Oh my god! I could turn her into a stellar winning machine in a month's time. I definitely do not want this mama! Yeah! See? Fiona's the harshest mom. She, she's so aggressive. She's not... She's not gonna be the perfect wife. The perfect um, housewife for Lloyd or a mother. Because like, if she's a mother of Anya... No way. She's gonna treat Anya like crap. Especially Bon. Bon, the dog. Okay? And it's not good. I would stick to Yor because Yor, she has the loving, caring nature of a mother. But with Fiona, that's like kind of aggressive. It's like you're torturing uh, a criminal or like a prisoner. Like, what are you doing? Anya's not a slave or a prisoner. Like, is that what you're. 
what is she doing? And it's a good thing. Anya has telepath power so that she can read her mind. Because this, Fiona is, she's a lunatic. She's crazy. Coco does have some nutritional properties, so this was a good choice. <laughs> Sometimes I just love you so much. Uh huh. Where's this coming from all of a sudden? Aww. The way you cleaned up my hot cocoa shows you're the best mama in the whole world. Anya! What kind of reason is that? <laughs> I can be loving The reason is she read Fiona's mind, so now she has to show love to her mama, your. Mine, you're so sweet to you. Oh my gosh, I ship, I ship you guys. You guys are like the best husband and wife. And Fiona, just get out. Just get the hell out. <laughs> you're you're ruining the family here. You're ruining the family. And I think when <laughs> Lloyd said uh, Anya loves loves yours so much. What about you, Lloyd? Do you love your? I think you do, because she's your wife. Do you mean that? Aww. I just said you're fine as you are, silly. Look at that fake smile. Listen, Nightfall. A spy must never show their true feelings, no matter what. Understood, Twilight. Kill your emotions. Show no weakness. Understood, Twilight. I'll strive to have a poker face for all my life. You mean Twilight in countless roles over. Yeah, guys. So next time we're gonna order. We're gonna order from the pizza pizza. <laughs> Mm, I don't like pizza. It's too much pizza. Yeah. We should order like another chicken wings, like the breaded ones. Like like I don't like bone bone. I want boneless chicken. Ay mo magpakita no. Dati very ano ka confident sa video ngayon ay mo. Did high school ruin you up? Kaila did high school mess you up? <laughs> you know seriously, if you're in high school, off topic again. If you're in high school, and if you don't want to show your face in front of the camera or do a video, and you're self-conscious about it and you, because of your insecurities or your flaws, this is normal. But at the same time, you're going to get over it once you're done high school. Because high school, it won't matter in the next couple of years or few years. It's not going to matter. The people who you used to go to classes with, it's not going to matter. Unless like you're friends with them, it matters. But it's not going to matter. Because what's important is that you know yourself, you know your worth, you know that you are you have values, you have morals, and their opinions of you, it won't matter. What matters is how you see, your, uh, how you think of yourself. You have to prove that you're going to do better. Want this? Good timing. There's something I forgot to tell you back there. For you your like next it? mission, you require a partner, so Handler has assigned me to accompany you. Oh, how could you forget to mention that? It should be top priority. Are you okay? I'm glad it's raining right now. Nightfall? I'll hide these feelings for as long as it takes. I'll brief you on the details at the hospital. Because that's what spies do. Because that's what you taught me to do. I have to. Until this cold war ends. But for now. I feel Twilight, bad. Even I... being your fake oh. wife would be enough. As long as I'm with you. I feel bad. The way she's saying things in her head, because like I understand that she's very fond of Lloyd. It's not just like her. It's not like a typical type of crush. Like oh, I have a crush on this guy, or because like he's so attractive. It's not like it's not like that. If it's more than that, if it goes really deep, then it's more than just a crush. I think she she loves Lloyd, and I understand that. And I'm sorry I've said so many things. Like I'm sorry, but like I just. I just think, like, for me, in my perspective, in my opinion, right, it's just her and Lloyd could could be good friends. 
should stay friends and I don't know. I think she will find someone along the way. Cause if it's if Lloyd and you are destined to be together, then she has to accept that. Because obviously the show is about the Forger family. And Anya even stated that she wants Lloyd and Yor as her parents. Playing house for so long has made you soft. On our next mission, I'll show you just how capable I really am. So try not to hold me back on our next operation. I'll make you realize that I'm the only one fit to be your wife. No one else. Yeah, but you can't... What if it's not possible for you? What if it's not possible for you to have him? Because eventually Lloyd and you're gonna fall in love for real. It's not gonna be fake, make-believe type of marriage, whatever. Because... And, <coughs> and for you to... You want to pursue that goal just to marry Lloyd? I, I guess... Some women, some girls, they have that kind of goal in their mind, but they just don't want to see it because I think they're embarrassed. And because, like, people are going to see them as, like, oh, they're desperate or I'm desperate. But, like, I don't have that goal right now, but I, my goal is to just, just enjoy, just enjoy what I have for now. And maybe love will come in the right time, especially for Fiona. That's a good episode. Oh my goodness. So in this episode, Fiona is her real name and her code name is like Nightfall. I think she's also in a different I think she works in another agency or she works in the same agency with as Lloyd. But I'm not too sure though. Because maybe she does, but and I think they've known each other for I don't know more than a year or they know more. They know more each other like, for a long time. And just by just by the way she visited the Forger family in the in the house, it's so obvious. Like it's for me, it's it's, it's obvious. Like she's she came there just to see Lloyd or see the and see his family, like or and his uh, wife, your. And I, at first, I'm like, yeah, she's, she, for me, she's so intimidating. Yona is so intimidating. And then I think she doesn't, she dislikes Yor because, like, she thinks, like, she's not going to be a good potential wife for Loy. Like, she's not a wife material. And she, <clears throat> she, in her mind, like, she sees that, she sees in herself that she's, she's better than that. Like, she's better than her. But to us, I think I, I think I'm sure you guys feel the same way. To you guys and to us, I think your is the best, the best choice. She's the best wife for Lloyd. That's all I can say. And she's not too desperate to, you know, just be with him. I mean, I mean like she does have that desire. Like the natural desire of just wanting to have a family. Like I get it. Like it's normal to pursue a guy. Like to pursue a man. Like in Fiona's case, it's normal. But at the same time, it's just. Hmm. I think it's best that she just stays friends with Lloyd because I know Lloyd cares about her. Like yeah, Lloyd does care about her. As a friend, but I mean, it can happen. Like, if Lloyd and Fiona were really in love, and then Yor just stands there, just watching them fall in love, of course, it's gonna be like, oh, that, 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 that's the worst. That, that's the worst thing that can happen. <clears throat> but if that happens, maybe it's just like a temporary type of thing in the show, or in the next few episodes. But. 
the whole entire story, it's always going to be Lloyd and Noor. I guarantee that. I guarantee that. And Fiona, she may have to find someone else. And uh, yes, she deserves someone better. She deserves a husband like Lloyd. But I'm sorry to say this to Fiona. No, you, you, your and Lloyd are together. Are always going to be together. And Anya doesn't want you. <laughs> sorry. Anya doesn't want you because, like, she's so harsh. Like, when Anya read her mind, like, oh, okay, I'm going to give, give Anya a beating and then, and scold her. If she does like does something bad or behaves really bad, like I wouldn't like as a mother, I wouldn't do that to a kid. I wouldn't do that to a child, like my child. <laughs> it's like you can't abuse that. You cannot abuse Anya or any. Oh my gosh, Fiona. I think Fiona is good for beating up criminals. <laughs> That's all I can say. I also understand how Fiona is feeling and what she's trying to do like her intentions is just to maybe just try to get close and win Lloyd's heart but Lloyd's heart is like just he's just focusing on the mission right now like he's focusing on making the family to look real and seem real because the thing is like yeah he can't he doesn't want it to change anything about the forger family because I think Anya's gonna be the the biggest. She's she's gonna be the biggest reason, um, for Lloyd and your like to stick together as a family. She's she's gonna be the whole reason as to why they're always together. And I think if Fiona can understand that, she has to like step step back and just just wish them their happiness and. That they're gonna do well. They're gonna be a happy family for real and they cannot break up. And if they tend to break up, like separate. And sep <laughs> stop. If they separate, it's gonna be what? messy. Yeah, like that. Like what she said. She said the F word. It's gonna be messy. Like, oh well, guys, this is my favorite lipstick. It's essence type of lipstick. It's called happy, because I'm happy. Sometimes, <laughs> sometimes I'm happy. Sometimes I'm like crying, a crier. I work. Everyone so was like, "This one she got is black." Yeah, black. <laughs> yes, <Yeah, I> pink. <laughs> She's doing it for me. And hey, white. Oh my god. Yeah. It's a keychain. See it? It's a care bear. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Show it. Where's the camera? The camera's here. Bear, it's a Care Bear. Care Bear. Care Bear. Very right, cool. Yeah. She has a boring eyes. But well, she bought it's it from nice. Minnesota. It's nice. nice. They know, gosh. And I know it's good. Levi. 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 So, yeah, we bought this from GameStop. Levi. Yeah, he's so hot. He's my crush right now. Yeah. One last thing. That's not my first. That's my mom's first. Oh my gosh, you're such a. And we got cock. It's your cloak, not cock. We got a skin. This is for this is for Tita Lin. No, this is for Tita Lin. Uh, my our uh, relative. She 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 was um earlier in the afternoon. She was like wondering why my skin is so glowy and so clear. <laughs> what? You're so racist. Because, <coughs> like, it's so clear and white. But, like, the thing is, I only put moisturizer and sunscreen. That's all I did. And, yeah, so this is the one. I cannot open this. I, I wish I can. So, they don't have the yellow type. Because this is the Vita C. The one that I bought, like, a few months ago. A couple months ago. This is the one I bought. Like, after putting vitamin C serum and moisturizer. I put this sunscreen. I know it's winter, but I have to use it. Come on. You have to use it. Even if there's no sun or... I still want to get rid of that um, dark spots or sun spots or age spots, whatever they call it. But this is work because this is made in Korea. <clears throat> so, and but this one, it's a different type of packaging that they have right now. So, they don't have the yellow. 
This one is a green. This is a heart leaf calming mineral. It's the same thing. But I was well, not the same thing. It's a different type of brand. But they do have the similarity of it. Like the sunscreen. So I might give this to her. Hopefully it works. And yeah. Uh, I bought one for my tita. My aunt, my aunt, my auntie. <clears throat> and so hopefully by the next time I see my other relative, I can give this to her. Yeah. She doesn't have to owe me any money. I don't need money. I don't need that. I need... Love. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> so we're gonna unbox Levi, my boyfriend. <laughs> He's gonna be the perfect man <laughs> from Attack on Titan. We're gonna unbox this. Oh, shit. Okay, um, we're gonna unbox this and... Oh, it's like something I want. I'm gonna assemble this. Oh my gosh, guys. Wait, what the heck? <laughs> He's beheaded. <laughs> Levi's head is beheaded. Oh my gosh, we have to assemble his head and his body. <laughs> my boyfriend's head. <laughs> My boyfriend's head. <laughs> and then. I'm just. <laughs> <It's so funny. laughs> oh my goodness. So, and this is the. <coughs> The, this, this, the stop. <laughs> the stopper. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna assemble this head now. <laughs> this is funny. Is, why do they have to disassemble the head? Like, what's wrong with them? Like, why can't they just... Oh my gosh, he can do his head like 360. <laughs> See that? Oh my gosh, this is perfect. Now we're gonna put him in the... <coughs> Stop him. There you go. That's Levi Ackerman. This is my boyfriend. See that? Oh my gosh. He's like, he's like, not look. There we go. You see that? Levi. Yay. So it's very light. I kind of like this. My boyfriend. <laughs> I'm kidding. Not really my boyfriend. My, yeah. Such a Delulu. So yeah. I love this. So it would be better if he has like a sword. But anyways, this is cute. <laughs> my boyfriend. No, 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 Yung kawan ko may. Tara, wag mo ibihet to ah, my boyfriend. Decapitate. Oh my gosh, she did decapitate my boyfriend's head here. She's so. She decapitated. Imagine. The titan just like. I don't want that. If, imagine. Okay, if, imagine if they try to kill <laughs> Levi. Tangi! Imagine if Levi turned into a titan. No, I'm like. I don't want him to be a titan. Because Aaron Jaeger, is it Aaron Jaeger? <laughs> Aaron Jaeger became a the Titan, right? So, but with Levi, he's just a normal, normal soldier. I should get Mikasa next time, but I think better I just get him. I love Mikasa because Mikasa, she's a strong female character. <laughs> but I didn't like the way they did her drawing. So, yeah. Anyway, that it's for today's video, and we'll see you guys in the next part. Bye!